so i want to route this display verification status display verification status i want to route it based on some skill okay what is the skill level so what is skill and all i will explain so because you are asking that i will finish by 25 minutes like that just wait on this here if you open an operator go to work tab here you can see skill so every operator may have some skill assigned here skill doesn't mean a specific thing skill can be a programming language skill can be a linguistic language that you speak or skill can be any other thing it can be like a uh, hr skill hr department like a human resource finance is a skill it can be anything that a person can have and that depends on your business type in a business there can be different types of skilled people available you can create your own skill here okay you can create your own skill here by clicking on this rule so just simply i'll tell you so skill gets created under the category which category it is going to get created under okay process category what is the category process category and every skill you create you can give a minimum value of skill level okay minimum low is by default one high is 10 you can leave it as it is or you can change minimum minimum skill level low is five five is low that's a minimum maximum is 10 you cannot customize more than 10 okay you cannot customize below one okay so now you will create a skill like this after you create skill what you will do you will assign the skill to the operator and you can give the rating level of this operator this operator is holding so and so skill and the less respective rating level is so on. Like this, what we do is we will take some skill here. Let's say Java is a skill. Suppose, or let's create a skill called Pega. So you want to send it to Pega manager with a skill level of, let's say five. Let's say five skill level, whoever has to them, I want to send it. Okay. So I want to assign an assignment to a manager whose skill is Pega and whose minimum skill level should be five understand okay let's create a skill and learn these things skill based routing skill based routing okay skill based routing let's go ahead here now and deal with this so now i'm going to give the requirement requirement is sorry so here in the parent case you have display verification status route the assignment of parent case parent case based on based on what based on skill and level skill and level so create a skill create a skill pega okay low one low one high 10 high 10 will give like this okay now so the above assignment should get routed to the operator it's not manager it can be anyone to the operator whose skill is pega and um, level is level is five exactly five level is five let's go ahead and work out this one so someone has asked some did someone ask me this yes or no who has asked this yes sir. okay okay just listen to this carefully but in real time this is a somewhat rare but okay okay it may be there in some projects but pretty rare and in interviews 99.99 percent .99 no one will ask you I, we are not facing this thing but okay no problem i'll create one skill now i am going to create a skill now process category create skill create skill this skill is something like a label that's it nothing other than that skill name is pega skill name is what whatever that uh, skill rating uh, whatever they told you that is the name and save this i am not changing anything here just simply save this now open 
three manager operators three manager operators okay three different manager operator ids you open records uh, organization operator id hdfc yeah? so search by hdfc filter by hdfc so manager one will take in an order okay manager one manager two and what else manager three will take in a proper order so manager one work tab okay so i think here i have assigned skills so manager one work tab here you will have an option like this and here you go ahead with a skill pega go ahead with a skill pega and rating i am giving three rating i am giving what three he has a skill level of three in the in pega okay manager two manager two go to work tab he has a skill of pega let's give five no let's give five you can have more than one skill an operator can have more than one skill next to manager three so manager three skill level is pega only but his skill is let's say seven let's say seven so you need to make sure that all the operators whoever whomever you are assigning all these things this checkbox must be selected otherwise routing won't happen so operator is available to receive the work then only routing will happen okay so now you are clear that some some operators have skill oh why i did not save or what why i am saving no okay no problem i will close open again and see manager 1 skill is there yes good skill is there manager 2 skill is there 5 manager 3 so we have three managers with same skill three managers with the same skill so let's proceed now and do workout on this now open parent case case type sorry parent case type and display and route to custom route to custom you need to choose route to custom to work list you want to route or to work queue work list means operator work queue means work basket i want to route to work list because i am sending it to specific operator okay very good mm. okay specific operator router so here router i am going to choose it to mm. To skilled group, anything is there like that? To skilled group means even more than one operator may have matching skill, send them. That's why you will find two skilled group. So two skilled group. Actually here two skilled group is one OOTB activity. What is this? OOTB activity of type routing. So it will route based on skill. So work group name. So what is the work group name? AIG managers, oh, ours is HDFC, no? HDFC managers team. So from the HDFC managers team, you have many operators, right? So in these operators, you verify for the respective skill and matching with the level. So whoever is matching with that level, send them all. So now update skill, click on update skill. So as of now, I did not provide any skill, no? Update skill, add item. It's like a repeating table layout. Add item. Once you click on add item, skill you can choose. Pega skill and the level should be 5, which is much needed. Which is much. If you don't select it as a required one, the level will be ignored. It will be sent for everyone. Okay, submit this and then save. So whoever from the manager's team, whoever has a skill of Pega with level 5 to them, it has to be sent okay this is a kind of they are calling it as intelligent routing intelligent routing so done now do I, oh i'm sorry create a case industry to which manager it has to be routed manager 2 so the parent case has to be routed to manager 2 so should i remove that uh, that one like 
flow action, all child cases resolved. I'll remove that. Okay. Because I have taught you something here, right? Just for practice purpose that I have removed. So that I, my parent case can be navigated forward. So here also, I will not bother about child cases. Waiting, waiting also. Okay, no problem. I'll finish the verification here itself. For everything, I'm going to do it from admin studio now. Previously, you remember that display is not routed to anyone, but now we have routed it. So customer search, single customer search. Proceed from here. And multi customer search. Where is it? Proceed from here. Customer details also, you proceed further forward. I need to fill, I believe, right? these things okay done so now it is waiting at for verification to be completed let's finish the verification thing okay so this test case how to run all this you should know submit this so once verification is submitted that has to be released it has been released so verification is completed the parent case would have been released let me refresh this refresh this and parent case would have been released to display assignment display verification status so now to whom it is routed you have manager 2 manager 3 like that right so let's log in with manager 2 in private window so I will take this manager to manager to at the rate hdfc.com password rules. What is the case ID? Eighth work object. Today's date, eighth work object. So now in the work list, uh, my work means work list, you should be able to see today's date 8th work object. Why is it? Manage it too now. Okay, give me one minute. I will just cross check that. Actions, view history, assigned to manager three now. Manager three, what is the skill level? Okay, okay. Manager three has skill level seven. So, so the Pega is functioning like this. So whoever has higher skill, if higher, if it is finding higher skill than that, it is routing to them. Okay. So maybe that's the reason why they're calling it as intelligent routing. Okay, if you give some rating level, above rating level is there, then it is routing. Let's test one more test case scenario. Okay, it, okay I will first give the screenshot, okay? Higher rating people are getting the assignment. Routed, okay, and do one thing. I will go to manager three, where is it? Manager 3. So, work tab. I am just removing this skill. I am just removing the skill. Manager 3, skill I have removed. Means higher than that, no one is available. Okay. Now, we will test one more scenario and see. So, if it is not working, then we need to cross check once. It should work. So, single customer search. As usual thing, I'll perform this. Multi-customer search, I will perform this.
and customer details also we will perform this. Submit. Okay, next verification case gets created. After that, only parent will get released. So let's go to verification case and do success. Some comments and submit. So now parent case should have been routed. Let me refresh the parent case. It is waiting actually. Now if you refresh this, it should be released from the waiting. I mean like the display you are refreshing. Actually it internally got released. Okay, and display verification status, view history. Now it is routed to manager two. Now it is routed to manager zero. So higher rating people are getting the assignment routed than the matching one, than the matching one. So when there is no higher rating people, then only it will be routed to. So now do what? Now remove the skill from, remove the skill from manager three and then test and then test. After you test what is happening, so when more than that no one is available then equal rating person is getting the assignment routed done now. so this is how you can implement skill based routing when no one is matching it will send to administrator when no one is matching with the skill when there is no one matching with skill then it will be routed to administrator at the rate pega dot okay that's how pega is defaultly designed okay so that's for your information an additional point okay clear everyone online students this is how you can implement skill based routing if you want to work with yeah. so next what are we going to do yes please Sir, uh, where will use the get next work? Get next work is a feature available in PRPC. Now the portals are not displaying it, but old borders will have.